Hi, in this video we're going to talk about something that you may have already noticed, which is that Carol can't turn right. So let's revisit our build a tower program. You were probably in a position like this where you had Carol at the top of a tower and you wanted to tell Carol to turn right, and so you maybe wrote a command that looked like this. But if you call the command, you would have gotten that error because Carol can't turn right. It's not one of the words that the dog knows. So what you had to do instead was turn right by turning left three times. And end up like this. But don't you wish you could say turn right? That was what you really wanted to say. At this point in the program, it would be natural to tell Carol to turn right. And so the answer, introducing methods. Methods are the way to teach Carol new words. So what is a method? A method is a way to teach Carol a new word. So what we want to do here is teach Carol how to turn right. So let's see what writing turn right looks like. Well, here you write private, void, turn right, open parentheses, close parentheses, open curly bracket, and then turn left three times, and then close curly bracket. Let's break that apart. So turn right, that's the name of the method, or the new word or new behavior we're teaching to Carol. And everything that you write is actually what you want Carol to do. It's the instructions. And everything goes in between those curly brackets. So everything between those curly brackets is the method body. Here you can see, turn left three times, that is the body of the method. So let's go into our code editor and use the turn right method. Okay, so here we're at our Tower Carol program from earlier, and I'll run it just to see where we're at so far. So we're at the point in the program where Carol has put down three tennis balls, and we want to turn right. But if we write that turn right command, like we would expect, we'd find out that we get an error. Carol doesn't know how to turn right. So instead, what we want to do is we want to teach Carol a new word. We want to teach Carol to turn right. So what we'll do is we'll write our first method. We'll write private void turn right open parentheses close parentheses enter open curly brace enter get our closed curly brace and then oops middle typo t u r n capital r i g h t and then we want to give Carol the instructions for how to turn right. What's the recipe for turning right? So to turn right we'll turn left three times. And so now we've taught Carol a new word. Actually, this part is teaching Carol. What we want to do is actually now say, Carol, let's do it. Let's turn right. So to give Carol, Carol a command, we write turn right, open parentheses, close parentheses, semicolon, and now let's run our program. So there we have it. You can see when we call the turn right method, we actually go and run those instructions. So I'm going to go use the step tool to, to look at this a little more slowly. So we'll see, you know, Carol's following the commands we expect. Football, move, football, move. Okay, now we get to turn right. Let's see what happens. Okay, we're about to do the turn right method. And so what we'll find here is that turn right is really a shortcut for what? Turning left three times. So now it's your turn to play around with the turn right method. 